Go to Symbol in Workspace lets you quickly navigate to other symbols, such as class names, functions, or properties in your current workspace. I'm going to bring it up just by pressing Control T on Windows and Linux and Command T on Mac. And when I do this, you'll see that I get this input box up here. And now I just type the name of the symbol that I want to navigate to. So I'm going to type out code action. And now what VS Code has done is actually search my entire code base for all symbols containing code action in them. You can see that it's ranking the most relevant ones up front. So these are um, entire exact matches for code action. And then as we go down here, we'll start getting less exact matches for all symbols containing the word code action in them. And if I want to navigate and see one of these, I'm just going to click on it here. And now I've instantly jumped to that symbol definition. And I could do that again. So let's just do code action again, and then go to a different one of these. So I can quickly jump to all these other symbols in my workspace. So this works out of the box for JavaScript and TypeScript projects, uh, but it also works for languages. Uh, let me open the docs here, the VS Code docs. It also works out of the box for Markdown. So if I go here, and now I'm in a Markdown file, and I do go to symbol and workspace. So again, Control T on Windows and Linux, Command T on Mac, and then say color, for example. You'll see that VS Code is now listing a bunch of entries here. And these are all Markdown headers. Um, so for various headings in these Markdown files. And if I wanted to jump to one of them, I can just use the arrow keys, I'll click on one of these, and then press Enter here. And I've instantly jumped to that heading. So that's also built-in functionality that VS Code has for uh, Markdown files. Of course, extensions can come along and add support for all sorts of other languages as well. So you can get support for like Java, C Sharp, C++, all these other languages as well that can be added by extensions. So that is the go to symbol and workspace command. It lets you quickly navigate to different symbols in your current project.